Hey everyone, this is Sunglass Rob from SportRx, and we're back with Evan Christensen. This Hello. time we will spell your name right. Oh, uh, will we? Will yes. we? Yeah, uh, we'll Evan see. is a Cat One racer. He raced mm -hmm. his first San Diego Bicycle Club and, and UCLA. UCLA, yep. And you went from paralyzed to third place in nationals in within eight months. Less than eight months. That's yeah. a whole story we're gonna have to get. That's another time. story. That's, that's a, whole that's a long story. one. That's that's more than this video though. Yeah, but uh, Evan Evan's been helping us out with some road bike videos. This video is gonna be about Prism Road, the lens, the lens tech. We do have a video on all our favorite road biking glasses. We also have a video on all our favorite Oakley road biking glasses. One thing to know about Prism Road is that it's an Oakley technology, so you can only get Prism Road in Oakley frames, but you can get it in prescription. We'll get into that. There's a lot of technical information about Prism Road. I've been in this industry about 22 years and it took me about a solid year to figure out how to explain it properly or how I think it's best explained. So let's go for a we'll ride. Get, we'll go in. Hey, let's see what you got. Yeah. I rode this morning. <laughs> oh, Anyways, yeah. um, but before we get into the technical stuff, I mean, you're obviously very experienced on the bike. You mm -hmm. interned here for a little bit. You're a fan of sunglasses. You collect yeah. sunglasses. We've hooked you up with some I sunglasses. Have a lot of sunglasses. I kind of want your opinion. My take. Yeah, your take without getting too technical first. Like, what is, like, I remember you put it on, you were like. These are sick. Yeah, yeah was, I mean, they're really cool because, you know, uh, I've worn a lot of cycling glasses. Yes. Um, but it, there's just something different about them. There's a really nice contrast, but then with like the lights, it's never too bright. You know, you get a nice level of like shade. Um, they fit really well. That's just the frame, but the lens itself, um, the the road always looks good. It always looks highlighted. Um, and I, I don't know, like it's, it's hard to explain. It is you're, kind of I, hard I, I, and I know now what you're saying. Like it's really hard to really feel. You're now, like, now what I'm saying. Now, now, <laughs> now, now. <laughs> Listen, hear me out. Uh, so I, I right think now. what you're saying is, is I've heard before, I had one friend explain it. He's like, it's almost like they're not fair. I'm like, yeah. it's like, what do you mean? He's like, I can wear them overcast. I can wear them really sunny. I can wear them all day rides. I can wear them short rides. And I almost feel like they're changing for you or they give you mm -hmm. like, they're not photogrammatic. Basically. They're not transition, but they always kind of feel like they're the right color somehow. The ones you gave me doesn't even, they don't even come with a clear lens, like, right? No, no, yeah, they're not. They don't automatically, you can get a clear lens. Yeah, but. I wouldn't wear them at night. Exactly, but like, it feels like you don't need multiple lenses. You don't yeah. need to interchange anything. Um, they're always, they were always really good. I've they're, worn them a couple times, they're pretty sick. So they were, engineered specifically for road, for being on the road. Most people use them for road cycling, but running they would be good for, and I've even used mine for driving and it works really yeah. well. So it, it kind of almost feels like there's a microchip inside the glasses and it's like reading what's going on and changing the tint and stuff, but it's not, it's, it's within the dyes. So Prism technology is an Oakley technology where they figured out with the use of different um, dyes, Prism dyes, they're able to manipulate the light spectrum. So instead of just making lenses lighter and darker, they're actually fine-tuning the colors of the spectrum at different parts of the spectrum to specifically help you see better in a certain sport or a certain type of condition. So for example, there's a lot of different prism lenses and the prism road lens is very different than the prism trail lens. In fact, for fishing, they make one called um, deep sea and one shallow water. And you would think, well, I'm fishing. I need polarized dark sunglasses. No, it's very different because you're looking, you know, at big blue oceans or within shadows, um, kind of closer to the shore. So yeah. they very, very, they've kind of done a lot of research to figure out what you need highlighted and what you need blocked for a specific sport or a specific condition and then actually can play with the light spectrum to mm -hmm. do that. The the best kind of analogy I've come up with is kind of like a if you if you um, compare it to like a stereo, way back in the day um, you can make lenses lighter and darker, kind of like if you can make the volume mm -hmm. quieter or louder. And then some of this color enhancing technology came out and if you want to think about it like treble and bass, well now with lenses you can make it lighter and darker and you can fine tune the treble and bass for your kind of like what you're into. Mm -hmm. Oakley Prism has taken it an extreme step farther where it's like the fade, the balance. Yeah, it's everything. You know, it's everything. It's like having a station. Yeah. <laughs> it's like having a sound engineer play with every single, you know, those big, huge boards and they're doing all this stuff yeah. to find, that's what Prism is like. Yeah, they, cool. And it changes. Like if you're listening to rock music or uh, country music, it, it's they're going to change it. It's the same thing. If it's road biking or mountain biking, they change the light spectrum. So that's why they feel so advanced 
advanced and they feel so um, like technologically out there, it's because they are. Nobody's yeah. really specifically playing with the light spectrum in such a degree for your sport. So when you put them on and you're like, well, it's overcast, they feel good. Oh, it's really sunny, they feel good. Or the sun's kind of still setting or still rising. Or this side of the mountain is really shady. This side of the mountain is really bright. There's a lot of glare right now. Um, it, 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 they're always, they always work because they've read what you need to do for cycling. So it's pretty amazing. Like I said, they do come in prescription. This is actually my pair of racing jackets, um, which I still love this frame. Uh, and this matches the Sporter X colors. I have a Sporter X kit that this matches with perfectly. And these actually do have my prescription in them. Mm -hmm. So they feel really, really good. Prism Road does come in prescription. You can get it in progressive. Oh, by the way, um, there are some lenses from the Prism family that are polarized, but not all Prism lenses are polarized. The road lenses are not polarized. So this technology is not polarized. There's always been an argument if polarized is good or bad for the bike. I've ridden many, many thousands of miles with polarized lenses and without like polarized lenses, I like it. Oh, I so, don't like it because it like when you turn your head and your Garmin like changes colors. Yeah, if your Garmin is 90 degrees and you're still looking this way, mm. then it then it blacks out the Garmin. But if your Garmin is this way and you're looking this way, you have way yeah, other it's problems. Yeah, it's fine, but like when, you, <laughs> yeah, yeah, you do. No, but like when you're, yeah, when you're that, turning, yeah, you're, like you're, the, with, you're throwing the bike. With some digital readouts, mm. but you could still definitely still read a Garmin with polarized yeah. lenses, but that's a whole other video That's another polarized one. lenses on the bike or not but oh just so God. you know prism lenses are not polarized um, so they do come in prescription here's here's just a really cool handful of frames uh, I'll throw these on why don't you put a pair on Evan just to just to these. check them out yeah um, so that's a lot of information about Prism Road. If you have any more questions, you can always email info at sportrex.com or leave a comment down in the comment section. Uh, we'd love to hear from you. If this video was helpful, please give it a thumbs up and we'd love for you to subscribe to the channel, but only if it's really in your heart. Mm -hmm. Bye. Thanks guys.